Hey guys, welcome to DJ Funko Pop Hunter. I'm Dave and today I'll be opening a waffle win from Cheap and Nerdy. I'll also be showing you some trolls from GameStop, Box Lunch, and Barnes and Nobles. But before I get started, I just want to remind y'all about the battles this evening. This will be the fourth set of battles in the Ultimate Mystery Box Charity Tournament, sponsored by Beard of Pop and Captain Pops. Tonight, Funko will be Funko Hunter versus Donald Newman at 8 Eastern. And that'll be the first uh, match. And the second will be Mama J versus Pops with Purpose at 9 Easter, Eastern. So please come and join us all. It's going to be fun. And we're going to see who's going to... Uh, the winners of these two will battle each other in the next round. And last night I won against YoJ Collects. And uh, Ope won against uh, Beard of Pops. So I will be battling Ope in round two. So, um, you know, stay tuned for all, all that. We'll be setting uh, those battles up in the next few weeks. Also, Poptopia Mystery Box. Um, we're trying to get to Mama J to 500 subs. Uh, check out the... Um, uh, what you need to do to be eligible in the description below. That's for uh, Mama J. Uh, she's at 497, so let's help her get to 500. And I'm also offering a giveaway as well if she gets to 500. So check out all the details in the description below. And I reached uh, 600 the other day, so my soaring to 600 giveaway. I'm kind of I'm gonna do it next week. I'm kind of letting the uh, the the you know the tournament uh, do its thing, and I want to do a live premiere. Uh, but I'm gonna wait till next week when things get a little bit uh, not so crazy. So uh, if you haven't entered yet, check the uh, what you need to do in the description below. So. I'm ready to get started. Uh, I really only have one box and a, of course, the box is the um, the Waffle Win. So I want to. Oh, I'm gonna save that one for last for any of you who didn't uh, weren't in that. I think Booze and Pops uh, last Friday. All right, uh, and of course, bag from. Box lunch, three pops in a bag, but at least they're in sores, but sometimes they still get damaged. And a couple of um, pickups from actual stores. So let me go ahead and get started. Um, I did show a couple of things last night on the uh, battle when at the beginning, but uh, in case you missed that, Barnes and Noble's exclusive Blue Troll. And uh, this one just kind of popped out of nowhere. Uh, we got all trolls, so I'm not going to take them all out. There is the rainbow, the teal, the uh, perp, well, no, pink, and the orange. All right, and uh, see the teal and the and the blue are, are similar, but this is the blue. It's a uh, more of a baby blue uh, than that teal one. And this is a Barnes and Nobles exclusive. So uh, there's also uh, GameStop. There is also an exclu exclusive troll from GameStop. It is the yellow troll, GameStop exclusive. I picked this one up the other day. All right, so those are the two exclusives. The uh, so far, anyway, <laughs> the yellow troll and the uh, the blue troll. So check out GameStop and uh, Barnes and Nobles for those exclusives. And they did have the, seems like uh, one of the trolls is really, really popular, one of the uh, commons. And uh, I had a little trouble get, getting it, but they got they got, they got a shipment in at, uh, at uh, <laughs> uh, GameStop. And, uh, of course, they held one for me when they came in. All right. It is the Rainbow Troll. All right, and this one's my favorite. I said I was only gonna get this one, but you know how that is, especially when there's uh, you know sales and hot cash and box lunch cash and stuff like that. All right, so I do want to pull this one out. So hang on. There we go. This is the 
a rainbow troll and I twirl the rainbow around a little bit and <laughs> go. Uh, no little jewel in the belly button. Some uh, some of them have them. Some a couple of them don't. All right, but this one is really cool. <laughs> All right, let me get them back in. Okay, so like I said, the rainbow troll seems to be really popular. If people are only getting one, I think this is the one that they're getting. So uh, make sure you get it before they totally sell out, even though it's a common. All right, uh, next, let's see where the box lunch bag of uh, pops uh, is going to have survived. Because even though they're in sorters, uh, usually, yeah, not usually, but they do put them in sorters. Uh, sometimes the sorters can get a little banged up in the, uh, you know, on the edges and it can maybe uh, mess up the the pop a little. I have had that, not too bad, but I have that ha had that happen a couple of times when things have come in the bag. Of course, 25% uh, off of your next purchase or entire purchase. And I think the, if you have box lunch cash, uh, it is going until the 19th and today's the 16th so you have a few days left. Hot Topic just started, uh, they had a pre-start yesterday and uh, it really started today and Hot Topic will go, uh, Hot Cash will go on until the 26th. So you've got some time there. Alright, so let's take a look. The boxes all look okay. Uh, there's a little slight dent right here. Let's hope that it didn't affect the pop inside. Okay, let's see, let me check that box out real quick. Looks like it made it in one piece with no dings or uh, crunches or anything. This one is the Pink Troll. And the Pink Troll, of course, has the little pink uh, jewel in the belly. In the belly button. <laughs> pink Troll. Uh, I think the Blue Troll has one, the Rainbow doesn't. Uh, let me see the... Uh, the yellow one does. All right, and we'll see next. Let me move them so they don't fall down. I had it in a kind of an unstable part right there. All right, moving on to the next one. All right, the next one is the Teal Troll. Teal Troll, pretty cool. All right. It looks like the box is in good condition. It's the good luck trolls. <laughs> these are cool and actually they look better. I, I like these better than the original uh, trolls. These are really cool. Uh, Teal Troll has no jewel in the belly button. <laughs> All right, so that's the Teal Troll. And they're, this, the blue and the teal are, are, are very similar, but there is, there, you know, there is a difference between the blue and the, and the teal here all right cool cool all right next one uh should be one left let's see it is the orange the orange troll and the orange troll has does have a little shiny uh jewel in its belly button get in my belly <laughs> like uh Fat Man and uh, Austin Powers. Get in my belly. <laughs> they should have done a, a pop of him, but they didn't. Maybe stay tuned, maybe they will, because they do have a few Austin Powers ones. But they should have done, uh, they should have done uh, Fat Man and they should have done uh, uh, Mini Me, is, if you ask me. So, <laughs> all right. So next, uh, well, the last thing I have to show y'all, because I'm really trying to, uh, my videos can tend to be a little long. <laughs> so I'm really trying to make them a little short, and I promise this one is not going to be 20 or 30 minutes. <laughs> All right. So, ooh, fragile. <laughs> what did I win, if you don't know, from the waffle by Cheap and Nerdy last Friday? <laughs> Came in the mail, I think, yesterday or day before, and I've just been ooh, itching to open it up. All right. Um, so, and I was like, wow. 
And I've really been on a winning streak lately. <laughs> I won. Uh, I I didn't show it on here because it, it, I I had one and and uh, it and it's a uh, and a a friend of mine, a very close friend of mine, wanted it. It was uh, at, at original Funko. You know, they, every day, or every few days or so, or it seems like every day they do at least one. Uh, thank you, Brittany, at Cheap and Nerdy for. Um, uh, boxing this up very well for me very well protected but like I was saying on, on at original uh, if you look on Instagram I did post a picture of uh, what I won uh, from what well, all you do is retweet, retweet uh, when it says that there's a pop that's for a giveaway and uh, I actually won one I, I won the uh, Hollywood Freddy but I had purchased one already and a, a dear friend of mine uh, uh, had has first dibs on it so in fact I, I shipped it today that's why I don't have it to show y'all but you can see uh, that I actually did I, I posted it uh, on Instagram and this is the card uh, that I got with it uh, saying thanks for being a Funko fan and congratulations on the win so I did post it uh, on Instagram if you want to take a look all right, this one is for those of y'all. Oh, ugh, awesome, 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 awesome. It's in a hard stack. Ugh, this is the first time. The only hard stack I have was the one from uh, that you were, you were able to buy. Um, the uh, blah, 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 which one from Target? Well, I don't know. No, it wasn't a Target exclusive. I, I picked it up at Target. The Futura, um, what's uh, Futura Darth Vader? Okay, uh, no, wasn't Futura. It was that uh, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, I can't remember. There's so many to remember. Uh, actually, yeah, the you know I had the Boba Fett, uh, which came in one also, and uh, but I, I didn't get that one at Target. I had to uh, buy it online. Uh, on Makari. Uh, so this is my first hard stack <laughs> that I actually win <laughs> or you know so it is the uh, 4,000 piece metallic Jollibee. <laughs> All right now I think it's worth like 165 or 170 depending on whether you look on PPG or you look on uh, uh, Funko app. <laughs> so I'm really, really excited about this one. All right, this is probably the most expensive one I have in my collection right now. I have a few uh, around 100 or over, but uh, this one I really, really look. The bottom uh, is kind of open there, so ooh, or it's dark, or it, like people usually do. They do, <laughs> but that's usually in mystery boxes. So to take, I got it. I got to take her out, and the box is in very, very mint condition. All right, but I do want to take it out because, uh, like Bearder Pop says, even your even the Grail expensive pops, you gotta take it out at least once. You know, just be careful when you're taking it out. Uh, don't just pop that box open or where you end up bending the um, bending the cardboard. I always use my trusty uh, letter opener in order to to do that. Okay, so here we go. Now we don't have any Jollibees. Actually, I had never heard of Jollibee until I started uh, collecting pops and, and I started seeing these Jollibees. And I would see people get them in mystery boxes, and I figured eventually I might get one. <laughs> but I got this in a waffle. <laughs> so, and uh, if you don't know what a waffle is, just, you know, ask some questions. <laughs> and you'll find out, because I'm not explaining nothing. <laughs> but uh, thank you, uh, Brian and Brittany at Cheap and Nerdy. All right, this was very awesome, 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 awesome. <laughs> All right, and let me get back, back in that hard stack. <laughs> All right, 
I'm going to have to. The bad thing about Hearts decks is, of course, uh, I want to see those new metallic ones. That who's coming out with those? I think it's uh, is it seven bucks a pop? Uh, getting ready to come out with the uh, metallic uh, hard stacks so that you can just kind of lift. I think they have the top taped, yeah, because you, you end up having to tape them so it doesn't fall. But thank you, I really appreciate it and I love it. All right, I was really excited. Like I said, I've been on a roll uh, that, let me uh, hang on just one second because I got some time yet, not much, but. Okay, so last night in the uh, the battle, <laughs> and that was stop, pop, and roll um, battle boxes, fifty dollars plus shipping. This pop is worth fifty dollars. Okay, so and the other three pops I had pushed me over, and I was able to win. So it's the Freddy in the orange suit. Uh, I'm not sure what this one is. Um, it's a character. I can't remember. Uh, but it, because it's something that I don't really uh, not familiar with, but I love my Freddy's, and this one is very special because it was the knockout punch. So I'm gonna pull this one open real quick. Yeah, and like I said last night, Yoj, I love you, but I wanted to beat you. <laughs> All right, so I forget which one it is. Y'all tell me down in the description below. And I was looking at it earlier, and I, and I can't remember. It's not a character that I'm familiar with. But I do love this. And I think I was saying it was pink last night because it kind of looked pinkish to me. Um, so, <laughs> uh, I'm sure people were laughing. No, it's not pink. It's orange. Orange. Okay, so time to go. Uh, check out all my description, uh, all my stuff in the link below about giveaways. Let's get Mama J to um, 500. She's almost there. Uh, thanks to everyone who's been uh, watching and supporting and uh, and and donating to uh, the ultimate um, mystery box uh, tournament for charity. So this is DJ Funko Pop Hunter beaming out until the next time. And if you haven't hit the like button, please hit it now. Peace. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Peace. Live long and prosper. <laughs>